guys, so today on Big Cast we are here again in AMZ Stadium in Suba for the Fiji Endure versus Oh, I was about to say Camera Vikings because we've been <laughs> thinking about the Camera Vikings game so much because this game is so bloody important and the Camera Vikings game hopefully they lose because uh, they're now Fiji Endure they're going to get a home final next week with a bonus point we need to stop talking about the future for a second the reason why we are already in the stadium is because it's not exactly the best weather today <laughs> as, you can, uh, as you can see up here it is not exactly the best weather this is Mel obviously you guys have seen her before if you haven't said a word yet you're not excited I am excited yeah, yeah, I am excited. How about I am excited? What about that? You're going to get into it. This is a big game. This is a massive game. Miji drew a win and uh, they also get the bonus point. Then that means they'll go above Canberra Vikings for now, which will mean a home final next week. And then, then we've also got to hope that Canberra Vikings lose to the Greater Sydney Rams. The Sydney Rays are coming eighth. So there's only nine teams in the National Rugby Championship, if you aren't aware. And the Sydney Rays are coming eighth. Fiji Drew are coming third. In regards to the Fiji Drew, they do drop the ball a lot and it's been torrential rain. It looks like it's going to rain again. Now, what, you, what is your opinion on the game is about to, uh, about to happen. Fiji Drew is going to win. You know, I can feel it. You can feel it? Yeah. You can feel it. Move. Go, son. Just, just if you feel it, just start moving. It's like an hour, an hour or so to go. Not many people here. Not sure how many people will come because even though it's only $5 tickets over there and $10 tickets here, it's still bloody bad weather. <laughs> it's still bad weather. So we'll see how we go. But uh, I'm thirsty. Thirsty. And I'm also thirsty for a win. Here's to you, if you want to, you want to, uh, you want to sponsor Big Gals Sport, you know what, mate? Can someone tell me who plays in what position? Because there's like, there's no numbers. <laughs> there's numbers. And then there's no nu numbers. And then there's no numbers. But, oh no, he doesn't. <laughs> Shocking box. Oh, yeah. Easy. Easy still. Alright, so we are here just before the game starts between the Fiji and Drua and Sydney Rays. I'm here with Kobe. Mate, what do you reckon of the game today? How have the Fiji and Drua performed so far this season? Well, the Fiji and Drua performed, their performance was very exciting. And uh, the way the players play is uh, quite unpredictable because they've got a lot of flares. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. Every time the Fiji has the ball, it's, it's very exciting because they look like they can score every time. The only problem is, though, is that they drop the ball quite a bit. So once they fix that part of the game, I think they're just going to absolutely wallop the competition. The last minute, you get to watch the Latoka match last week. Yeah. What do you think of the refereeing in that match? <laughs> well, it's rugby, eh? Yeah. One win, one loss. Yeah. That's the ref's decision, and we, we can't spoil the game. Yeah, exactly. Well, it was, it was quite rough in the same sense. It is rugby. You have to kind of deal with that stuff. In my previous video, as you guys saw last week, I was uh, giving the refs a little bit of uh, a little yeah. bit of talk after the game. What do you think of today's match? Obviously, it's such a big game because if they win, and they win well, and Canberra lose tomorrow, then they'll get a home final next week. Yeah. But if they lose, they could potentially not make the final. So what, what, do you, what do you think of how important is this game to Fiji? Every game is important to yeah. Fiji. This game is also like a final. Yeah. And uh, by the way, the look of this game is going to go. Well, Sydney Rays can make a, can make an upset also. They can. Well, they did beat Perth Spirit last week, and they scored like 50 points. I think it's uh, the growth in rugby, the overseas introducing uh, rugby in Australia when Jindro plays is uh, boost the players' uh, morality. Yeah. And. Uh, the desire that they will have to play the game will be different level. Oh, I think it will definitely grow for the uh, fine Fiji inside as well. Obviously Fiji and the 15s haven't been fantastic lately, but I think that this will definitely start to grow them. We really start to kind of grow Fiji as a nation within the world of sports. So I think it's fantastic. Oh no, we're in South Africa 2010. It's the same ref as last week, I'm not even joking. I'm not even joking, that's the same ref as last week. You are kidding. I got a comment from one of you guys saying that the same ref is gonna be repping this week and that's just ridiculous after last week. Absolutely ridiculous. Man, I'm not looking forward to this now. I'm nervous, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. This is what I'm talking about. Get it out wide, get it out wide. Oh, he's knocked it on, it's all right, it's all right. Jeez, he nearly got a nice little intercept there. If he intercepted that, he was away. Come on. Oh, man. Honestly. 
Honestly, they just lose the ball 24 7. Yeah. Oh, man! This is an opportunity to be. They've just scored again. <laughs> Half time here of the Drua versus Rage match, and Drua are getting beaten 12 0. I'm here with Sam. Hey, what's going on? Like, what is going on? Expected more from I'm hoping for something. I'm so frustrated. I'm so frustrated. Come on, man. Oh, they scored again. Nah, this is beyond a joke, man. This is beyond a joke. And it's definitely a knock on. There is no way he scores there. No way. No way he scores here. There's no way he scores there. There's no way. Between the Drew and Rage, and unfortunately, we did lost 36 29. But that comeback, I'm yeah. here with Frank, mate. What about that comeback? That is unbelievable. It's unbelievable. It's a typical future of the Rockets. I know the Rockets. But with respect to Australia, they are smart. They play smart. 
but the really the goal for Beck it was incredible. Yeah, it was unbelievable. Now the thing is, is that we just heard the Fiji qualified for the finals yeah. in the first year in the tournament. Like, how does that make you feel? I feel so good, I feel so happy, and uh, I'm joined with my ABC at home in uh, Italy. Uh, they actually were given free tickets from the Brown family and the uh, Mr. Brown, uh, James Brown, oh, uh, Sydney Racing. Right? Yeah. So we just came to enjoy the game, and we are really happy yeah. that the draw is confirmed, and even though we lost. Yeah, well, they were down 29 yeah. nil. came I, back in an absolute barnstorm. We've got people leaving at 29 yeah, nil down. I wanted to leave, but <laughs> I just had to watch the game. Exactly. What do you think for the finals? Do you think they have a chance? Should be, but uh, we got into the count and since we was scared they want to defeat the flying pigeons. Yeah. And they should uh, put them a fight, but uh, at least they should reach the top four. Also, I'm here and I'm with the big fella <laughs> from the Sydney race. Mate, where are you taking that win? Well, mate, it's a good finish for our season. <laughs> yeah. We've been struggling a bit this season, but it's good to get the win here, especially here. Yeah, it was a close four victory, obviously. They, they came back, they came on strong, but you guys held on in the end. What did you think of, obviously you said that you've, you've had a good end of the season, yeah. um, but he cursed me as well last week. Yeah. How do you think that goes into the next season? Um, mate, like, that's a big boost to us for next season. Like, we, we, could, we could have started a bit better for the season, but to finish off like that, that's nice. Yeah. And what do you yeah, think of the Fiji side going into the finals? Oh, well, mate, um, they, they're dangerous when they when they are uh, on the day. If, if, if they get up on the day, they'll be Anyway guys, that's going to be it for today's video. If you like it, please do a big thumbs up so I know that you're enjoying this content. What a second half. Like, you had told me that that game would finish 36-29 when the game at half time was 12-0 to Sydney Rays. Like, I tell you what, I would have said you are a lunatic. But anyway guys, if you did like this video and you are a massive sport fan, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. Also hit notifications so that whenever a video comes out, bam, 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 man, it is in your subscription feed. That's a World Cup video coming up. That's a World Cup video coming up. Very excited for that. Actually, Fiji play right now. I'm not too sure what the score is. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Catch you later. Sit down, guys.